Anything na mahalaga ay uh, binibigyan natin ng atensyon yan. We make sure na hindi ito na papahamak o nawawala. So, uh, anything na valuable, we make sure that we take care of it. And there is something na talagang very valuable sa buhay natin, and that is time. That's why sa Bible, ang sabi is redeem the time. What does it mean to redeem the time? Ibig sabihin ito ay hindi natin ito ahayaan na masayang o mawala. To redeem is to save. So to redeem the time is to save the time. Which means na posible na ang oras natin ay masasayang o lilipas na ito ay hindi nabibigyan ng ano, tamang uh, atensyon. Halimbawa, if you just think about yung nakaraang oras o nakaraang ilang oras, for example, uh, it's very easy na lumipas yung time na hindi natin to nagagamit o na ma-maximize ng ayon sa kalooban ng Panginoon. So, to redeem the time really is to uh, look forward at kung paano ito magagamit uh, to glorify God. And uh, basically, ang, ang pag-glorify sa Panginoon is simply to fulfill yung kanyang will or purpose ano, na kanyang uh, nire-reveal sa atin through His Word, but also through discernment. So, each time na tayo ay, for example, may gagawin, uh, we can easily do that. For example, itong uh, upcoming uh, few hours, no? We can easily do that na sa sarili lang nating uh, wisdom or interest o ano man. But we can actually devote that to the Lord. We can actually ask God for the grace to honor Him doon sa mga parating na activities natin for the next few hours. We could say na, Lord, uh, would you guide me and help me sa kakausapin ko o pupuntahan ko? Would you direct me and help me? so that uh, I may pay attention to your voice. Now, we cannot just take for granted na yung mga darating na oras will just happen the way the Lord would want us to, uh, you know, go through that. Uh, it really depends on whether we are willing to ask. And that's what we must do, no? To redeem the time is to uh, use the time uh, wisely to the glory of God, to uh, commit yung the next uh, few hours uh, to the Lord and to ask Him to guide us dun sa gagawin natin and to ask from Him specifically yung mga kailangan natin in order for us to glorify Him. Otherwise, it can be lost. Uh, yung mga darating na oras can just pass us by and before you know it, tapos na yun. So there's always that uh, uh, chance na we can use the next uh, hour or so na that we want to just glorify the Lord and reflect His person and uh, be the kind of person He wants us to be. So, redeem the time. Huwag natin sayangin yung oras. Huwag natin na, na, yeah, na lumipas lang yun at yung mga pinagagawa lamang natin ay mga bagay na hindi naman uh, ayon sa purpose niya para sa atin. Of course, ang susi niyan is to grow in the grace and knowledge of God. So, God bless. Music